was a tough night in the Tyson Event Center Monday as Indiana Wesleyans rode to the championship game win through Shawnee State of Ohio. During the first half, the Lady Wildcats put up a good fight, holding the normally high-scoring Bears to 24 points. Both Indiana Wesleyan and Shawnee State came out with a strong defense, tying the score six times. IWU then regained its strength, earning its only double-digit lead of 10. The Lady Bears then came back, letting Indiana Wesleyan close to a six-point lead at the half. But during the second half, IWU lost control of the game, letting Shawnee State score the majority of its points down in the paint, adding a total of 26 points onto the scoreboard. It was close down to the final seconds when Shawnee State had the chance to take back the lead and IWU couldn't get the ball back. Albers, near side, Ballman, Ballman drives the baseline, trap, ball knocked loose, scrambling for the ball, it's loose, it's picked up, out they go, here's Albers for three, it's no good, rebound, Ballman, Ballman with seven seconds, underneath Catrice Mitchell, hits it and she's fouled! The missed free throw gave the Wildcats another chance to take the lead. After crossing the half court line, a timeout was called. Steinbarger looks, swings it in, the ball's tipped away, Shawnee State gets it and the ball game is over. The Lady Wildcats end their season with an impressive record of 27-7. I'm Glenda Rojas in Sioux City, Iowa for your Wildcat Central update.